Uh, Codders, great news this morning. You've signed a new two-year extension at Ealing Trail Finders. How pleased are you? Absolutely delighted, Ollie. It's, uh, I've really enjoyed my couple of years here so far and delighted to commit for another two years and looking forward to the future. And how much do you enjoy working here? Oh, I love it. I uh, really enjoy working with Ben, the rest of the backroom staff, and uh, the boys have been outstanding. They've worked incredibly hard since I've been here. and. Uh, just you know, in a way, probably that second 40 on, on Saturday at Hartbury probably uh, summed them up. Incredibly hard working, some really good skill and an outstanding performance. It's a real statement to make to sign until 2020. You obviously see this as a very attractive long-term project. No, definitely. I think uh, when Ben and I sat down a couple of years ago, that there was a clear vision. Uh, we made big strides through to the hard work of the players due to them, uh, but obviously it's still a way to go. So uh, as I said, we recognise that we need to work, and it's just uh, getting now down and cracking on with it. And what would you say your highlight is at the club so far? Oh, listen, there's been a few. I think certainly the Yorkshire away game and that second leg last year on, on telly, uh, just the way we finished. And the, again, the resolve, the attitude and the skill to fight back and win it was, uh, was a real statement to win against the team on the road of the quality of Yorkshire. And I think you look at Bristol this year, how close we came to, to beating a, a side of that quality. So uh, certainly some really positive signs, but as I said, we, we, we know there's plenty of work still to do. It's obviously a very positive start to the season. It's good to see that all the hard work you're doing with the coaching is paying off. Oh, it's not down to myself or Ben, it's down to the players. They. Uh, they go, and, uh, they go and perform, and for 95% of the time this year, they've done that. As you say, really, really positive league performance. A couple of disappointing, disappointing periods, uh, but to their massive credit, the week after, we really bounced back. And obviously, the BNI has been a positive start, but we recognise that this week's a key game for us. In terms of the more immediate future, it's obviously an exciting time ahead. A couple of BNI Cup games and some huge league games coming up as well. Yeah, and no, we, we, as you say, we've got home and away now to Rotherham, which is. We're in a good place, but we know we need to have two big performances and obviously a big local derby coming up to Christmas. So a busy month of December. We started it well on Saturday, but it's really important we kick on. Um, and obviously the new two-year deal in terms of the playing style, you want, obviously want to see that continue to evolve? Yeah, absolutely. It's about For me, it's always been about balance. Um, we, we've shown real progression this year in a number of areas. And, and again, it's just that focus of, of looking at the small details, how we can get the players to, to get a better understanding of, of what we want and, and also make them enjoy the game even more. I think you saw, again, times on Saturday by just us, us putting teams under pressure, enjoying not having the ball and looking to get it back. And, and when we did have the ball, I thought we scored a couple of great tries.